12. Star-Nosed Mole Imagine a creature so bizarre it looks like an alien from a sci-fi movie, with a nose shaped like a pink star, composed of 22 fleshy tentacles that act like tactile eyes. Each tentacle, part of a unique organ called the Imer's organ, contains thousands of sensory receptors, about 25,000 across the star, sending data to the brain faster than you can blink. That's nearly five times more nerve fibers than a human hand has. This mole measures just 17 to 20 centimeters long, approximately 7 to 8 inches, and weighs around 35 to 75 grams, 1.2 to 2.6 ounces, about the size of a tennis ball. Its super-powered snout lets it smell underwater by blowing bubbles onto a scent source, then inhaling them back, a trick unmatched in the mammal world. But the real shocker? It's the fastest eater on Earth. Its brain decides in as little as 8 milliseconds whether something is edible, and it can identify and devour tiny prey in just 120 milliseconds. So quick, you can't even see it happening. This mole lives in wetlands and stream banks where it digs tunnels, forages above and below water, and even swims under ice, never missing a beat in its high-speed sensory world. 11. Mexican Mole Lizard Bipes Biporus Imagine a creature that looks like the love child of an earthworm and a lizard, without back legs, and you've met the Mexican mole lizard. In fact, this bizarre reptile is so tube-like that its body is 18 to 24 centimeters, 7 to 9 inches, long but only 6 to 7 millimeters wide, making it almost as thin as a spaghetti noodle and pink to match its surreal, worm-like appearance. Yet it's not entirely legless. It has two paddle-like forelimbs, each tipped with five claws, used to scoop soil as it tunnels beneath desert sands. These limbs are vestiges of its evolutionary past, its hind legs vanished long ago. Dive deeper into its story, and you'll find a tail that can detach on command, not to regrow but to block predators as it slips away underground. This animal lives in the sandy soils of Mexico's Baja California Peninsula, burrowing just 2.5 to 15 centimeters, 1 to 6 inches, beneath the surface to hunt termites, ants, larvae, even small lizards, and it pulls prey underground to enjoy its meals in safety. In place of ears, it picks up sounds through vibrations channeled via its skin, sensing danger without needing external ears a clever adaptation to life in darkness. Despite its creepy design and a local myth claiming it emerges from toilets, a fun but false horror legend, this shy creature is harmless and fascinating to biologists. 10. Worm Lizards, Amphisbenians Imagine a creature that looks like a worm, but is secretly a reptile. Enter the Worm Lizard, or Amphisbenian, a bizarre underground dweller that defies expectations. These weird reptiles share over 180 species worldwide, found on nearly every continent from Africa to Europe to South America. Most are small, slender, and limbless, often measuring 15 to 30 centimeters, 6 to 12 inches, and weighing under 0.23 pounds, 100 grams. Their skin is divided into visible rings that make them look like living scale-covered earthworms. Worm lizards move underground using a unique accordion motion. Their segmented skin anchors into the soil, then their trunk pushes forward inside one ring after another. Some species even retain tiny forelimbs, like the Mexican mole lizard, which we covered earlier. But most are completely limbless. Their heads are tough and shovel-shaped, a perfect tool for burrowing through tough soil. Their eyes are covered by skin and scales, so they don't rely on sight, but they can detect light and vibrations instead. Even better, they can drop a tail like a lizard to distract predators and escape. Some worm lizards, like Amphisbena alba in South America, reach lengths over 80 centimeters, 2.6 feet. They are known to raid leafcutter ant colonies and prey on larvae in their deep underground galleries. 9. Jerusalem Cricket, Potato Bug Picture a cricket with a large, bald head, round, shiny, and eerily humanoid, 
topped by a body striped in black and brown like a creepy mask. These underground wanderers grow 1.5 to 2 inches long, about as big as a matchbox car, and weigh up to 13 grams, small but impossible to ignore. They live most of their lives hidden under garden soil, lurking beneath rocks or logs, only emerging on mild nights, especially after rain, when they forage on roots, tubers, or decaying insects. You won't hear these crickets sing. Instead, they drum the ground with their abdomens, creating vibrations that flutter through the soil. Males drum, females reply. It's a full duet vibrating through six specially tuned legs. When alarmed, they'll rub their hind legs across their abdomen to release a hiss. Think friction, not air. Despite their unsettling face and awkward gait, they aren't dangerous. They lack venom but can deliver a painful bite with powerful jaws, mainly defending themselves, not attacking. Known as child of the earth or skull insect, they hold a place in folklore and even mythology among the Hopi and other tribes. 8. Giant Gippsland Earthworm, Megascolides australis Picture a worm so enormous it could stretch across a school playground, yet lives its life entirely underground. The giant Gippsland earthworm is one of Earth's most extraordinary invertebrates, and spotting one is like glimpsing a living legend. These worms typically span one meter, 3.3 feet, and weigh about 200 grams, 0.44 pounds, roughly the size and weight of a standard paperback novel. But in rare moments of glory, they can extend to a jaw-dropping 3 meters, 9.8 feet. You could walk over their home without noticing, but if you listen closely in their moist clay tunnels, you might hear a strange gurgling noise, like water swirling down a bath drain, when they move hurriedly. This eerie sound is often the only sign of their presence. Living deep underground in just a few small pockets across southeast Australia, these worms are fragile. Disturbing the soil can harm them, making them nearly impossible to study up close. Their reproductive rate is slow. Females lay a single large cocoon each year, and it can take 12 months for a baby worm, already 20 centimeters long, to emerge. 7. Solifuge, Camel Spider No, it's not a spider. Yet with its alien design, this desert predator feels straight out of science fiction. Camel spiders belong to the order Solifugae, with over 1,000 described species across 147 genera, roaming dry lands from the Middle East to the Americas. These creatures reach up to 12 centimeters from snout to leg tips but more realistically, they measure around 5 to 7 centimeters in body length. Their name, blending Latin words meaning sun and flea, captures their behavior perfectly. They burrow or hide under rocks during the day to escape the blazing heat. Now, speed, but not human chasing level, still freaky fast for an arthropod. They dash across sand at up to 16 kilometers per hour, 10 miles per hour earning nicknames like Wind Scorpion and Kalahari Ferrari. These aren't venomous monsters, but their jaws are terrifyingly powerful, capable of slicing through hair, skin, and tiny bones like scissors. To molt, brood eggs, or shelter, they dig underground burrows using their strong legs and pedipalps, no silk involved, to carve out tunnels as their secret fortress. Females often lay 50 to 200 eggs in these burrows, and fiercely guard them until hatching, a protective move rarely suspected in such a fierce-looking hunter. 6. Amblypygy, tailless whip scorpion. Picture an arachnid that looks like it crawled from darkness itself, flattened like a pancake, arms stretched wide like a shadow in movement, and body spanning up to 10 inches, 25 centimeters, in leg span. These ghostly creatures, known as amblypigi or tailless whip scorpions, walk sideways using only six of their eight legs, while the front pair have transformed into ultra-sensitive whips that explore the night like living antennae. With five families, 17 genera, and over 210 described species, 
Amblypigids hide in caves, under bark, or in forest floor crevices, emerging at night to hunt with raptorial spines called pedipalps, like mantis arms, snapping prey with surprising speed. Despite their frightening look, they are harmless to humans. No venom, no silk, just powerful whispers in the dark. Life underground doesn't mean isolation. Some species, such as Phrynus marginimaculatus and Daemon diadema, demonstrate rare social behavior. Mothers gently caress offspring with whip legs, and siblings reciprocate touch, a touch of warmth in a cold, underground world. These creatures live five to ten years in the wild, even surviving up to fifteen years in captivity. 5. Giant Huntsman Spider, Heteropoda Maxima Imagine a spider as wide as your dinner plate, but perfectly silent. The giant huntsman spider, discovered in a cave in Laos in 2001, holds the world record for largest leg span. Between 25 to 30 centimeters, 10 to 12 inches, widths nearly matched by only a few other arthropods. Despite its steely size, its body is a modest 4.6 centimeters, 1.8 inches, long, and it weighs around 167 grams, just shy of the mass of the Goliath bird eater, making it lighter but far more elongated. The cave calls it home. Its pale, crab-like legs, with joints that bend forward, help it creep through limestone caves in Laos, and its full-sized eyes suggest it hangs out near the entrance, not deep in darkness. Perhaps even darker is its love life. After mating, the female may sometimes eat the male, a behavior shared with widow spiders. Females also lay up to 200 eggs, guarding them until spiderlings hatch. 4. Cassilians, amphibians that feed their babies, skin, and milk. Imagine an underground creature that looks like a shimmering earthworm, but is actually a limbless amphibian, complete with teeth, a skeleton, and one of the weirdest parenting strategies in the animal kingdom. These are Cassilians, mysterious burrowers living in tropical soils across South America, Africa, and Asia. Some grow nearly 1.5 meters, 5 feet long, bigger than many kids. With skin banded in rings and a skull built like a bullet, Cassilians dig through soil using hydrostatic locomotion. Muscles compress their trunk to push forward inside, just like a hydraulic tube. Sight is mostly useless underground, so they evolved a pair of sensory tentacles between their nostrils and eyes to smell and feel their world. But here's the real surprise. Cassilian moms feed their babies in two extraordinary ways. In many species, including Bulingerula titana and Herpoli squalostoma, Mothers grow a fatty, nutrient-rich layer of skin that their young scrape off with special teeth and eat constantly. This behavior, called dermatophagy, lets babies grow incredibly fast and even helps pass beneficial microbes from mom to child. Meanwhile, the species Siphonops annulatus takes it further. Moms produce a milk-like liquid from glands near their cloaca that young suckle directly gaining fat, nutrients, and microbial protection in a single strange gulp. 3. Blind Cave Crayfish Imagine a crayfish so spooky it looks like a walking ghost beneath the earth. No eyes, no color, just translucent shells and long, twitching antennae. The Salem Cave Crayfish, Cambarus hubricti, for example, lives only in the dark waters of Missouri's Ozark Caves, growing around two and a quarter to three and three quarters inches long, about the size of a toy car, but far more otherworldly. Across the U.S., similar species like the Doherty Plain Cave Crayfish, Cambarus cryptodites, live in Florida and Georgia's limestone aquifers. These eyeless, pigmentless creatures stretch to about 2.1 inches long, with antennae double that length. Their lifespans may reach 20 years or more, thanks to their slow metabolism in these dark, energy-poor habitats. Deep in Alabama's Shelta Cave, scientists rediscovered the tiny Shelta Cave crayfish after 30 years. No pigment, no eyes, and Napoli called a dancing ghost. It drifts across silty lake bottoms like an underwater phantom, 
coexisting with salamanders and bats in its hidden aquatic world. Across species, these cave-dwelling crayfish survive groundwater-restricted ecosystems where contamination or disturbance can threaten entire species. 2. Giant weta, burrowing species. Imagine a creature that weighs more than a sparrow yet hides quietly beneath the soil, nature's underworld giant. The giant weta is one of the heaviest insects on Earth, reaching body lengths of about 10 centimeters, 4 inches, with leg spans over 17.5 centimeters, 7 inches. A rare gravid female Dinacrida heteracantha once tipped the scales at 70 grams, nearly 2.5 ounces. That's heavier than many birds. These hefty insects evolved on New Zealand's predator-free islands, growing to enormous sizes in a process known as island gigantism. There are 11 giant weta species, including the mole weta, a burrower, and the famous weta punga, or little barrier island giant weta. Reaching adulthood can take up to two years, going through about 10 instars, molts, before they're ready to mate. Once mature, most live under nine months, but their lives can still stretch close to two years. These armored giants sport spiky legs and long antennae. Many species have seen dramatic range declines due to introduced predators like rats, but conservation efforts on predator-free islands are giving them a fighting chance. Giant weta embody hidden strength. Massive, slow-growing, and hidden beneath New Zealand's forests and grasslands. 1. Olm. Imagine a creature that looks like a baby dragon, but it never grows up. The olm, or human fish, is a pale, blind salamander that lives its entire life underwater in Europe's deep limestone caves, especially in the Dinaric Alps. Its body is long and eel-like, reaching up to 30 centimeters, a foot in length with frilly red external gills waving like underwater flames. Unlike most amphibians, the olm spends its whole life in the larval stage, retaining gills, a finned tail, and tiny limbs that look like they belong to a tadpole frozen in time. With no skin pigment, its body is translucent and ghostly, sometimes tinted pink, which inspired legends of cave-dwelling dragons. But here's the real shocker. Olms can live for over 100 years, making them one of the longest-lived amphibians on Earth. Even more incredible, they can go a decade without food, slowing their metabolism in the nutrient-poor darkness of caves. Instead of eyes, they sense their world with electrosensitivity and fine-tuned smell, detecting prey like insect larvae, snails, and tiny crustaceans in complete blackness. A living fossil, the olm shows us that survival doesn't always mean growing, seeing, or rushing. Sometimes, the secret to life underground is eternal youth, patience, and just a touch of dragon myth. The underground is full of secrets we've only just uncovered. If you loved this journey, dive into the next video waiting on screen, hit subscribe, and join us as we reveal even stranger creatures every week.